So what started out as a simple 60 foot long brick ranch house with no really defining entrance. Uh, we added this elegant portico with a barrel arch type. So this is what it looked like before and I used the backhoe to dig these footers and put the sauna tubes, pour concrete about two feet high. And then uh, I got these home store type fiberglass columns and uh, built a framework, took off the gutters and fascia and stuff that was in the way. And uh, now it's time to cut these parts. Now this eight foot piece of plywood is not long enough to reach the corner. I'm gonna fill it in, but to mark it, I had to add a piece of scrap to extend another five inches. And then I'm able to like snap my chalk line for the final cut. I cut all these curves with the circular saw as well. If you don't plunge the blade too deep, it'll actually cut slight curves. The guys are roofing up top. So I got this temporary brace across to keep this from spreading because it's essentially a cathedral ceiling in here. But now that all these plywood braces are nailed on, they're doubling as supports for the curved ceiling and they're also tying the rafters together. And they're just nailed down alongside the rafters. I got one more to go on the outside edge, and then I'll have to make a custom piece to fit over the outside, and a custom piece to close up the end of the arch right up against the uh, roof rafters. Here we are all set up, bend in the middle. Now if you can see that, I held up, tacked up the pieces and traced the backside to cut, making that in two halves because it's larger than 24 inches wide. Bent up the sides. And then there'll be one more on the inside edge up against the soffits once the soffits are in place. And I got one more big piece on the back above the door. And uh, then we're ready for soffits and put some trim around that. Bottoms can be uh, trimmed out with fake stone or whatever you prefer to uh, give it a finished look. 